Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today we are doing another cider haul. I'm so excited to be collaborating with Cider again. I absolutely love their pieces. This top is from Cider from my last haul. If you haven't watched it, go check it out. I think it may have been my last video actually. It was about a week ago now, but I absolutely love Cider. I appreciate them so, so much for working with me now. This is the third time I think I've worked with them and I've loved, 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 loved every piece that they've sent me. Before I get on with the video, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and TikTok as well. It is just Jessica Jessica X. So I do have a discount code for you guys as well and it is just Jessie underscore YT for an extra 15% off. Also, I'm gonna link all the pieces below in the description box just so you can go straight to each item or go shop on the website as well if you want. Okay, so I'm just gonna pull them out the bag random. They're all random different bits, mainly for my summer holiday that's coming up. So I'm gonna just show you. So I picked up this satin. It's like a sort of, it's like an olive green satin crop top shirt and I just thought, with some like shorts on the night. This is gonna be really, really nice. It's a little bit creased at the moment, so it is something that I'm gonna have to iron and then try on. So the back has got like, it's like a little cutout piece there, so I quite like that design. And then you've got the strings here as well, which is where you're gonna tie them at the front. It looks really nice on the website, so I thought I could style this up. Surprisingly, it's actually thicker than I thought it was gonna be. The material is really good. I thought it was gonna be quite thin, like a, a thin satin shirt, but it's thicker than I thought it was. It is long sleeve as well. So I do like the fact that I can wear this when I get home as well. Even when it gets cooler in England, I feel like I could style this up with like wet look leggings and stuff like that. Just add some jewelry to this. And I feel like this is definitely a nighttime shirt. You could wear it in the day if you want, but I definitely feel like this is giving me more nighttime going out vibes on the night with some like shorts and some wedges or maybe even some like a nice skirt or some nice leggings but then I feel like it might get a bit hot on holiday. I got this in a size large. I always get worried because I always feel like I'm bigger than I am and because I'm like big chested I always like to make sure that I've got a bigger size. This is the tight waist blouse top and it is £20 on the website. I've never actually had a bikini from Cider before. So this time I did pick up some bikinis. I always get really apprehensive getting bikinis from somewhere where I haven't tried their bikinis in the past. But when these came, the cups are actually bigger than what I thought. So I got this beautiful blue material and I don't really know what this is. It's not the waffle material, I don't think. I don't know what you would call this, but it's a beautiful like, it's not baby blue, but it's like, it's not like royal blue either. I don't know, I feel like it's in between, but it's like really like, I feel like it's just a nice pop of color. So it comes in the top and then the bottoms are quite funky because they're like thicker here on the bum and the vajayjay and then the sides are like that which is actually you can actually adjust the sides like that so i quite like that and it looks like that may be high rise as well by the looks of it the back i would say is not full coverage you're going to be looking at like a half coverage bum but i feel like bikinis nowadays aren't full bum anymore i can't remember the last time i saw a bikini that covered the whole bum but then again i feel like you don't really want a bikini that covers the whole bum because it kind of gives me that like nappy vibes and i'm like yeah i actually don't have a blue bikini i actually got so many bikinis now for my holiday to take content in but i didn't have a blue one it's like i'm trying to get bikini in every single color and i'm here for it i'm sorry but this color with a tan and hopefully my hair i've just had my hair done today actually I'm hoping it will go like blonder in the sun as well. I feel like that is a vibe. This actually really thick quality as well and it's quite stretchy. It's a lot thicker actually. A lot of these materials are thicker than I thought they were gonna be. I do find my bikinis, sometimes I buy them and they just snap on holiday and I absolutely hate that. So I feel like it being a thicker material is hopefully gonna make it last longer and be more sustainable. So I got the top in a large. I think large was what it went up to. I think that was the highest it went up to and because it's in a set the bottoms was then in a large, but because it's got the adjustable sides, I think I'll be absolutely fine with that, to be honest, as a large, it doesn't look that big. And I'm just hoping these are gonna cup the puppies. I actually think that that is quite good coverage for a bikini. Nowadays, I swear to God, they're like half the size, like 
literally like that and i'm just like oh i got some bikinis not long ago and literally like none of them fitted and i was like mm, love that for me so that was the texture solid triangle bikini set and it was 15 pounds 15 pounds is really good actually i don't think 15 pounds is bad for a bikini set if the quality is good so i picked up this dress and there's like a designer dress similar to this what it reminds me of and i know if you're like big on instagram you will have seen people wearing it was it like a last summer thing i think it might have been a last summer thing and it was like a green sort of knitted and i think it had like yellow sort of swirls or something on there but this is what this dress reminds me of but i just thought this was such a cute daytime dress i probably wouldn't wear it in an evening i mean i suppose you could but I feel like it's very daytime vibes. It actually goes in at the waist, if you can see a little bit there as well, which I love because I like it when it sort of hugs your figure. There's nothing worse than wearing dresses and they're just like rectangle and you're like, and you look like you've got no shape to you. And then you've got adjustable straps here, but I'm gonna show you. It is kind of a thick material, but I feel like it would be okay because it's like early there straps or whatever you call them and it is a midi dress so I feel like it would be okay to wear even though it was knitted on holiday. But I really love the sort of like Hawaiian little flower starfish whatever they are on there on here. I picked this up in a small so the reason I picked this up in a small is because I know these sort of cottons I think I explained this in my last cider haul I always size down when I know I can tell the material is going to be stretchy so it hugs my figure because I know it will stretch. I hate buying like cottony sort of style clothing and then you wear it and it's just baggy on you in all the wrong places and I just hate that. So I always size down. I feel like I've really learned my body over the years and materials that fit my body, what works, what doesn't. Like there'll be certain clothing that I just completely avoid because I know it just won't fit my body type or it wouldn't look good on me. I feel like this is different and just cute on holiday. Just some sandals, just some sandals maybe, flip flops, walking around. I can even shove this on top of a bikini so happy with that and this is the knit floral midi dress and it is 26 pounds then i've also picked up another bikini it's not in the same material it kind of looks like it but it's not so i picked up this sort of like nudie woven style looking bikini it looks like wiccan is that the word it kind of looks wiccan and again the size of the cup is actually not that bad and this is also in a large i just thought because i've got like white cover-ups and nude cover-ups i feel like it was essential to get a nude colored bikini plus as well i feel like nude tones are just i just love instagram pictures when they're like nude tones or nude tone clothing especially with like blonde hair and stuff i feel like it goes really well obviously i have to get one like i said guys i had to get a bikini in every flipping color and then these are the bottoms again i feel like that's going to go high waisted over the hips which i personally like the coverage is a bit more here on the bum but again it's not like nappy nappy coverage i'm really excited to try these on and get some good content don't forget to follow me on instagram guys because that's why i'm posting all my pictures is the solid texture triangle bikini swimsuit and it is 16 pounds and it's in the color camel so the next thing i've picked up is these earrings i liked these because i thought these were just a little bit different they're hoops but they're like square hoops and they're sort of like slanted and bent and i just thought they were really like just really cute and stylish i love wearing hoops and i feel like smaller hoops are kind of in now as well so these are the geo design earrings and they were four pounds so i feel like i've picked up a few dresses today which is good because i needed dresses for my holiday and I don't feel like I picked up a lot of dresses last time. I think I might have only picked up one dress or maybe two. I don't know. So I got this sort of nude style dress. It's going to be quite difficult to show you on here. But I'll insert the clip obviously when I try it on. It's open here. So it's got like a split leg. So obviously your leg's going to be out here. But then you've got sort of like an under layer bit here and you've also got the tie here so you can adjust it and make it tighter if you wanted to or shorter maybe potentially i'm gonna say this is gonna be like a bit of a maxi length dress 
and I picked this up in a, I think it's going to be a small again. Yeah, so I picked this up in a small again because, like I was saying before, the material, it is stretchy material and I knew that I could fit in a smaller size. So hopefully that is going to look really nice on. I feel like the design is very different, like the one thin strap the one thick strap and then the split leg and the roof so i feel like that's going to be really pretty on the evening maybe with some like nude heels or some wedges and i feel like that's just going to be light and easy to wear and this is the ribbed one shoulder ruched midi dress and it is 24 pounds and it's in the color tan as you can see as well it's like that ribbed material and i absolutely live for rib material okay so this is going to be quite difficult to show you but obviously i'll show you in the clip when i try it on anyway i got this really beautiful Beautiful. it's like a teal color two-piece and this is the skirt to it as you can see it like ruches up the side and I think it's like a midi length I'm gonna say I am a bit worried because the waist seems really big here I did get it in a large because I think I went by measurements I knew it was that kind of material there's no stretch to it but I do think that that potentially may be quite big on my waist so we'll see how that goes i might have to send it back i can kind of tell already that's going to be quite baggy on my waist ah right okay so the material is actually stretchy in the middle but it's just the top band here that isn't stretchy so if you could get it past your hips and get it onto your waist the rest of it because of the ruch detail is actually quite stretchy so that's the skirt bit to it it comes separately so you can choose different sizes the top is one of these ones you have to tie up so you like put it on and then like wrap it round and then tie it the way they had it on the model of inside a picture as well that they tied it up on the back and then it was like draping down the back so it looks really nice it is a really beautiful silky teal color and this actually to be fair this is stretchy this material i got the top in a, a large as well i'm really interested to kind of like see how this is going to be on obviously at this point i haven't tried anything on in the clips you'll see i would have obviously tried it on then i'm just hoping it all fits so that i don't have to send it back i don't know how much things are to get tailored i've never had anything tailored so maybe if it didn't cost that much i might just get it tailored a bit because i feel like the top's going to be okay but it's going to be more so the skirt so we will see i'm honestly so obsessed with two pieces and i just think i've not got anything in this beautiful like teal color so on the evening with a tan i feel like with my hair all done i feel like this with some heels is going to be really really lovely so the top is the solid cross wrap tie front tie back tank and the top is 16 and then the skirt is the solid ruched slip midi skirt and the skirt is 18 pounds. I feel like this is a really fun, cute bikini that I've picked up here. It's probably a little bit different actually to all the other bikinis that I have. I picked up this lemon bikini. I just think it's so cute and fun. It's so bright and I love it. I feel like the bra is a little bit smaller on this one, but I'm hoping I can still squeeze in. I guys, I am losing weight, right? But all I'm gonna do is lose weight on my boobs as well, and it just doesn't seem to be working, and it's really offending me, if I'm honest. I lost like 15 pounds, and my boobs are still flipping humongous. First world problems, when life gives you lemons, Beyonce. <laughs> That's so cringe, but. So we've got the bikini top. I'm gonna believe it. it's a large, and then the bottoms here, which is, oh God, the bottoms. Oh my God, okay, they're tight anyway, so <laughs> they're tight, so it's fine. Um, I love the fact that they've got these little tassels. How flipping cute. The top, uh, the bottoms I got in a large as well, so I've just picked them both up in a large. I'm just really excited about that. I think this lemon bikini is under a white cover-up. I've also got um, some cover-up trousers, white like flared ones coming soon. So I feel like that would be really cute with those as well. I honestly can't wait to take content. I know that that's sad I'm going on holiday and I'm thinking about content, but I just got so many cute pieces. I'm like, I can't wait to take photos in them. This is the lemon print triangle bikini set and it is 15 pounds. So again, another two piece that I picked up. I feel like if you've seen the advertisements for cider, you would have seen this two piece. It's quite a popular one on there. So you have the top line like this i actually really like the back as well it's got like a gold zip at the back it's funny because i picked up this in teal as well and i think like my last cider haul i picked up loads of green 
green things and then this time I picked up loads of blue things and I'm, I just love it. I love having different items of a colour palette. So I'm really into like different colours lately guys. I'm like, I'm kind of living my best life right now. So I got the top in a, what did I get this in? I picked the top up in a large. I'm really hoping that that is going to cover the boobs because it's not very long i'm gonna be honest so it might i'm just hoping like no nipples fall out the bottom and try and run away because that wouldn't be great would it and then the bottoms are trousers i do love a trouser two-piece guys i really love a trouser two-piece so i picked the trousers up in what size did i pick the trousers up in these are in okay i've got the trousers in an extra large guys so I don't know if this is going to be a massive on me. The legs are wide leg anyway, and they don't look that long, to be honest with you. But I'm just worried about the waist, so this might be something I might have to send back or get tailored. But how nice are these trouser pants? Like, how nice are they? They've got like the, what do you call that um, strip down the middle? like the ironing strip thing isn't it like i think that this is going to be really nice on the evening i'm really hoping this isn't going to be too big and then that was the solid stitch straight leg trousers and the trousers were 26 pounds and then the top is the solid v wire tank top and it is 15 pounds and then the last thing i got was another dress a black dress which i haven't really bought black in a long time so here she is it is a tie around the neck, a bit like a bikini, and it is just a midi dress. It's just split up the side and then it's got the ruche. It's a little bit like the nude one, but without the detail up the top. It is a ribbed material as well, if you can pick that up on the camera. And there is stretch there in there. So I did pick this up in a small because I could see that it was going to be stretchy. Just so it's going to be quite figure hugging. To me, a tan and a black dress, red lipstick, hair done, body oil on, some wedges or some heels. It's just 10 10. You always have to have a black dress in your wardrobe and when you go on holiday. Just in case. Just in case you've ate too much at the buffet and you're feeling a bit wear black black always makes you look skinnier so this is the solid rib ruched midi dress and it is 20 pounds so guys i hope you enjoyed this haul i hope it gave you some inspiration for your holidays i'm so 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 excited to go away and just wear all these pieces i can't wait they're all in my wardrobe and i'm like oh my god i just want to wear all these things don't forget to use my discount code just jesse underscore yt for an extra 15 percent off i am going to link everything below and the discount code below in the description box so go check that out and don't forget to follow me on instagram and tiktok just jessica jessica x and also leave me a comment subscribe to my channel and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like bye guys have a beautiful time